Let's talk about using QuickBooks in multi-user mode. QuickBooks Pro and Premier work in two different modes, single user and multi-user. If you're using QuickBooks on a network, QuickBooks will enable you to have up to five people accessing it on that network at a time. Multiple users can access the company file only in multi-user mode. You will find that there will be needs for you to switch back between single user and multi-user mode. For example, only certain actions are permitted when the company file is in single user mode. These actions include some types of changes to lists, such as deleting, merging, and sorting. Number two, changing company preferences. Number three, creating or working with accountants copies. Number four, backing up, condensing, rebuilding, or verifying data. And number five, importing or exporting data. So even if you're normally in multi-user mode, you'll find that at certain times, especially with backing up, you'll want to change and you'll have to change to single user mode. Right now we're in single user mode. Let's switch to multi-user mode by coming under the file pull down menu and switching to multi-user mode here. We're now in multi-user mode and QuickBooks shows us who is logged in. We're logged in as administrator. Let's log in as one of our users. Open company, login, and let's log in as Cindy. Now you can see we're logged in as Cindy up here. Let's test Cindy's security settings. Let's close some of these views. And let's come in to banking and let's write a check to ourselves. You can see that the permissions do not allow Cindy to go into the banking area. We set up Cindy to do billing. Let's test this and see if Cindy can do billing for us. Let's come in to invoices. We can see that we can get into the invoices area. Here we can process invoices and edit invoices. This is what we want Cindy to be able to do. If we need to switch back to single user mode, mode to do one of the five things we just discussed, such as backing up, simply come here under File, Switch to Single User Mode, and that'll take you back to the single user mode.